Hello everybody, Sift here again with another potato run and today I will be doing a harvesting run. Now you would expect I'm gonna play with Farmer because he gets 5% increased harvesting gains. Honestly no, we're gonna of course go with Entrepreneur as he gets 50% more harvesting gains from everything and of course we're gonna scale harvesting as much as we can. Now for the build itself, uh, let's begin with the Taser as it is a support item and I would like to get support items because those give you more harvesting for free without needing another item. Um, but of course, I would like to transition over to a shield build as the shields do more easily more damage because um, because the taser itself needs elemental damage. And I don't think this guy has weighted items elemental damage. As far as I know, all his weighted items have to do with harvesting. So it's not really that easy to scale. Uh, here we're gonna go, of course, with five harvesting. So we start the ball rolling. Let's get a taser. I mean, if it appears, it appears. And look at this. We already have 15 harvesting from five harvesting from here and five harvesting from the level. And we already have 15. So you can see this guy scales a lot faster. And we're not gonna we're gonna actually use the five reroll coins. Let's lock down the coupon and let's also lock down the taser. This ability this guy ability says that he loses all the money at the start of the wave. So there is no reason to keep the money or try to um you know not re-roll because we have some money etc in the bank now here you might say yeah but if you lose all the money then the harvesting isn't going to be that important at the end of the day and that is obviously completely wrong this is like a, a strawman argument here <laughs> that i just generated and the reason for that is because the main thing we want to achieve with harvesting is gaining a bunch of levels because the more levels we gain through harvesting um the better it's going to be the plan is to get like a million harvesting plus i would say let's get five harvesting again and um, yeah, we're gonna buy the coupon and we're gonna buy the taser. And uh, I would even go as far as to say, let's buy this and we're gonna get the money back like almost instantly. And let's lock down both of those again. Coupon seems to be a weighted item on this guy. In case you didn't know, we're playing with mods and uh, we have made it so only weighted items appears in the shop. So this guy can only find the same items again and again, which uh, on the one hand makes it a bit more streamlined, I guess, straightforward, or maybe some could theorize, theorize it as something negative. But I think it's positive that you only get one item, uh, you know, 10 item types and nothing else because that makes the runs more unique. That makes it so that, you know, this guy's run is going to be harvesting, 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 harvesting. It's not going to be attack speed, it's not going to be anything else. You're just gonna get a bunch of levels. And that's the plan in general. The plan is we get a million harvesting and then uh, level by level we just get, uh, I would say let's go one element damage here. Which, uh, yeah, we're actually got, so now we're doing six damage. Nice, we're gonna get coupon, we're gonna get another taser. So our elemental damage is trying to slowly scale. Yeah, now we're doing still six damage. Uh, I would say we rolled trying to find our taser. We found two coupons. I have never ever seen the shop sell the same item twice. Never, never. And uh, here we got our coupon. I'm gonna buy the taser first, as that's gonna increase our harvesting alongside the elemental damage. And then we're gonna lock down the coupon. And uh, yeah, I think we got all our five coupons. Now, people have been telling me to maybe do a coupon run, like just try to get a million coupons. I think that's a pretty boring run, honestly, making the whole uh, shop cost zero. I could do it and I might do it. I'm not saying that I won't do it, but I'm just saying that I think it's more fun having infinite money than just making the shop cost zero. Of course, making the shop cost zero is true infinite because you can buy everything forever. Even if you tell me that, no, no, actually, Sift, you cannot buy everything forever because if the shop is selling uh, three different weapons that you don't have, then you literally cannot buy them. Well, that's of course wrong. I can buy and sell weapons again and again and again, and then just recycle them into recycling them into recycling them, so I get the free rerolls. Uh, I'm gonna say 10 luck because I, I really want to get the chest. And two armor is also good, but we want 10 luck here to start finding chests and whatnot. We found a rocket launcher. Uh, I could theoretically buy a rocket launcher just to carry us a bit. Yeah, let's get a rocket launcher. Why not? Why not have a rocket launcher carry us a bit? We found uh, luck in engineering. We lose a bit of damage. I'm gonna say yes to that, and I'm also gonna say yes to uh, this. So let's buy this, this, and I wouldn't even say let's buy this. It's gonna pay for itself very quickly. Uh, I don't have enough money for anything else, so I would say let's just go. I don't even need to lock this down. Now, this does 28 damage, but still, it's pretty good. It's definitely better than those. Yeah, nice. So, j just because this run is going to be a harvesting run and a support run, does not mean that my weapons are going to be that. And at the end of the day, I, I don't even want to stick in the elemental, in the in this elemental, whatever, support build. I, I want to actually get weapons that do things. Like, we want to get those mini guns, those, um, anything, to be honest. Those obliterators, those snipers. Just get whatever weapon we later will find in the path. We don't need to specifically stick to tasers just because, oh, our starting weapon was a taser. What I actually want to get, though, is a rainbow chest. Can I get a rainbow chest somewhere around now? That would be really helpful. And also, um, really helpful. <laughs> that, that's the main aspect. 200 coins. We already have started scaling quickly here. I would say, let's uh, get max life. I don't want to lose. And I would say, let's get two armor. I also don't want to lose. Taser number three. Very nice. Let's combine these, buy this, and also white flag. For sure, we want less opponents. We don't need opponents. We just want to scale our harvesting. And now taser. We are scaling very fast by these two. Let's continue. Another taser. Very nice. 
Uh, I'm going to combine these and buy this. And I would say buy this. And I would say buy this. Let's continue. Another fertilizer. We just continue with those. Uh, 20 reroll coins. Might as well uh, buy another one of those fertilizers. And, uh, and a B because I have the money. And now my harvesting is already at 144. I really, 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 really would hope that we will find our first rainbow chest now at wave 6. It's already a bit too late. A bit too late. But we can still do it as long as I'm a bit lucky and get my first chest right now. Because the moment I find my first chest, here we go. Now the madness begins. Because this is going to be a crown. The crown is, of course, going to make it so instead of scaling um, 5% plus the 50% that is building the character, we're going to be scaling 13% uh, plus whatever is built in the character. So that 13% in reality is actually going to become more than 13%. Like, it's going to become 18%. And the same goes with the 5%, right? Normally, you scale 5% harvesting every turn. Uh, well, he increased that by 50%, so we're not actually gaining 5% per round, we're actually gaining 7.5% uh, per round, pretty much. Nice, and we got our first rainbow chest, and let us begin with the crowns. So, crown is supposed to be unique, but we're not, of course, gonna adhere to that rule. Let's see where the crown is, look at this man, 40 harvesting and 8 damage, I'm gonna take that later, uh, a lot later, actually. We're first gonna just scale on crowns. Harvest, actually, I'm never gonna take that, we're only gonna scale on crowns. Harvesting increases by an additional 8% at the end of the wave, so from 5%, it's now 13%, but it's not 13% because he increased it by 50% on top of that. So this is actually uh, about uh, about 20%. I'm going to say none of these. I'm going to say... Uh, no, no, this is useless at this point. Uh, let's go with 6 life. I really don't want to lose. And I would say 8% damage. So we increase our damage back to what it used to be. Christian's max life, honestly, no. We're going to continue scaling, harvesting, harvesting. Uh, might as well get some free rerolls in. Because that is 5 plus 0. Oh, no. Yeah, um, it's a bit buggy. Anyway, engineering and armor sounds good. These are definitely goods. Um, yeah, let's get that. Let's roll. Here we go. Blood donation machine. This is a bit too dangerous for us right now. If I take this, we might... We will die. Not we might. We will 100% die, so we're not going to take that. I do not have any... I don't have enough healing f to maintain that thing. We're going to continue with these. Consumables, heal. You know what? Let's buy this. Start healing a bit. And yeah, we will continue with these. We're not going to become a melee build no matter what. Here we've got the harvesting tractor. Man, literally next round. Look at this. My harvesting is already at 300%. So uh, I should have bought this instead of the other one. I'm not going to lock this down. There is no reason for me to lock down anything. We have already 44% chance to dodge, by the way. So we are already very good here. Now, DPS isn't really good. Like, uh, my money gaining and anything related to money is good, yeah. But anything related to surviving the round... I mean, dodge, yeah, maybe okay. But anything related to healing in a round or uh, killing opponents or, you know, anything that has to do with the combat itself right now is very bad. Now, as I said, the plan itself is not to actually become completely busted. The plan itself is to be to get so, so many levels that I will just gain like 200 health per round uh, and a bunch of random stats because honestly, I'm not going to be uh, going through every level one by one as uh, if we start getting like 100 levels per round. Yeah, <laughs> we're not going to be sitting there and just going through the levels. But you're going to see here in a moment the madness is going to start. Uh, already right now, we're prepared to see like three levels at the end. Ah, we only got one. Okay, okay. Maybe not as crazy as I was thought it was going to be. Uh, I'm going to say we want luck here. Uh, I'm going to spend enough money to maybe find luck. Unless it goes through the... Here we go, 15 luck. I definitely need to build up luck. This guy does not seem to find luck within his levels. I'm going to go with speed here. That's also a good choice. Uh, harvesting against armor. Mm, not really a good idea, but we have dodge, so might as well buy this. I would say this is unique, so let's buy just to remove the mutation. I don't want to see that again. Let's buy for zero. Let's buy these, both of them. Reroll. Uh, get the free reroll. This costs 24, and it's going to give us a 21 free reroll, so might as well buy it. Uh, and then for the rest of the game, of course, it's going to still stay with us. Zero. Uh, oh, we somehow re reset the rerolls. Something, something buggy happened. I don't know. We continue buying those. Still zero, still zero. Yes, this is good. 10 harvesting. We lose elemental damage, which is pretty much all my weapons. But the thing is, the harvesting is pretty high and also increase the other types of damage. And as I said, I'm not really going to stick to the whole idea of... Well, I'm saying that, but <laughs> I'm not going to stick to the idea of having tasers as my main weapons. But the thing is, I, I, I don't see much avoiding that. Let's, uh, let's continue with just building up harvesting and more and more and more. Here we go. Luck and harvesting. That's even better. And uh, we're going to still buy these. And I would say we're going to lock this down. I don't need that. And this is going to slowly start building up our damage again. We lose elemental, but we gain the other two types. I don't know, man. Uh, the damage is going to be hard. Like, fixing the damage and general being a decent build is going to be hard until the point where uh, we just become busted. Which, uh, we're not there yet, but we're slowly closing in. Like, I just need to find two more rainbow chests. So if I find two more rainbow chests and bring my harvesting scaling up to 30 or 40%, uh, then 
Wait, did I just stop re-rolling at some point? Did I just throw away a bunch of money? Or did I run out of money? I think I ran out of money. Well, I'm not sure. I hope I did actually run out of money. Now, come on. Nice. We found the rainbow chest. Exactly what I wanted. Now, that was about what I was saying. I still feel very weak and a bit afraid. But the thing is that I just need to find a couple. Oh, come on, I'm not gonna get that guy in time. Yeah, there is no way whatsoever I'm gonna kill that guy. I mean, we're not even killing here normal dudes. Maybe this thing, though. Okay, I got it, but... Come on, come on, come on, come on. Trying my best here. Trying my best. Okay, I want to avoid death, of course. We got one chest. It is what it is. Let's continue scaling our harvesting. 696, by the way. We're, we're, we are close. We are slowly getting to that crazy amount. I'm gonna say it one more. And here I'm gonna say 9% crit chance. 9% movement speed. I'm gonna say 9% movement speed. And 10 lag, of course. So we're gonna continue with the scaling lag. My lag is at 86. Let's uh, buy some tasers, my guess. Continue decreasing our damage back to zero. Combine and buy this. Another taser, another one of those. Let's roll pretty much everything. Nice. We start throwing away our armor, though. That sounds... That feels a bit dangerous. Uh, lose a bit of dodge. Yeah. Uh, another ba bazooka. Another one of those. Honestly, I don't need to stick to this whole idea of tasers anymore. How much does this do? 18 damage. Yeah. We don't need to stick to the whole idea of... Yeah, of, of tasers. We can just rotate over to whatever we want. Uh, I need to stop buying these. It's killing my damage completely. Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna stop buying this. I'm definitely not gonna become a melee build. Heavy explosive. Oh, this is really good. I'm gonna buy nuclear launchers. So uh, let's combine these and buy a nuclear launcher. It's heavy explosive. This is heavy explosive. For, so we're very much into the heavy explosive idea. Let's, uh, let's continue reducing my melee damage though. Explosive elemental. This, this is a no for me. Like, it sounds good, but honestly, I, I don't really want it. Roll for 10. This is a yes, this gives us melee uh, range damage and lose elemental damage. As I said, I'm trying to transition over to another build. Let's take that too, as long as my dodge is above 60. I'd also like to maybe do, go with the shield build. Uh, what is... Oh, this this is no longer support. This is armor, 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 dodge, 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 and then also armor, armor, max health, speed, less. This is super tanky. The spiky shields are actually really good. I think I'm going to transition over to this too. Maybe I should go for spiky shield build. Honestly, we're just going to go with the bazookas. Because what is more uh, harvesty heavy than seeing a crazy guy with bazookas come along and be like, these, these are my weapons. Let's continue re reducing our dodge. Not that it matters. Let's go here. Let's go here. No, now we need to increase our dodge again. So now it's back. Heavy elemental. We also take a flamethrower. It does 1 times 5 damage. Yeah, it doesn't do that much. Uh, but it might be a bit better than 2 times 2. So let's like this, buy this. Let's continue. I do still enjoy this as an idea. Uh, let's buy this for even more money. And uh, let's buy this for opponents move slower than us. I mean, I'm just going to lose 3% speed. Might as well. It's unique. Remove it from rotation. And uh, I'm going to buy one more of these. So my dodge is above base. And I have 900%. Another percent. Straight up flat. I have 900 harvesting right now. And we are at wave 9. The best wave of the game. So theoretically, the, the bazookas, the RPGs or whatever they're called. Are definitely going to be helping. The nuclear launcher seems to be really good. To be honest, seems to be doing uh, a lot of job. So maybe this is going to be a nuclear launcher build. I am not sure yet, but maybe it is. Maybe it is. I wanted to do a nuclear launcher build with the other guy. With the explosion guy. You know, just to see how explosive it's going to get. So maybe that's going to be tomorrow's run. Uh, but that would mean that I'm going to do the same run today and tomorrow. I mean, we're going to use the same weapon, I guess, today and tomorrow. Hmm. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to think about it. Oh, we got our first rainbow chest of the round. Hopefully that... Oh, no, we already got the rainbow chest. Hopefully we're gonna get the second one, actually. Because this is a guaranteed rainbow chest. And nice, we got two of them. And this here is going to make a huge difference. A huge difference. One rainbow chest in comparison to two. It's like night and day, man. Night and day. Nice, we got two more. My harvesting continues skyrocketing. We're gonna continue picking up as many... Uh, by the way, where is this? It's an engineering. We buy this and we buy another one. And here I would say, uh, this is a guaranteed purple. Yeah, uh, so we're going to try to get luck if I can. So we continue increasing pretty much everything. Mm, nice, let's go luck. Elemental damage, uh, percentage base damage, elemental damage. And we found a sniper, gun precise. Honestly, I don't really want a sniper. I do enjoy my elemental build here that we're going with. Uh, let's buy this, reduce our dodge again. Reduce our armor again, reroll. Reduce damage and dodge. I need more bees right now. Yeah, I definitely need to increase my bees again. Buy this. Uh, buy. Found another rocket launcher. Mm, let's throw away... I would say this. 3 times 5. When did this increase in damage? 8 times 4. Maybe I should just throw away a taser. I guess. Or just combine rocket launchers and buy another one. Why would I risk it? Now a taser, not really. 
Uh, still scaling pretty much everything here. Harvesting against damage, yeah. Harvest What's happening with the free rules, by the way? Harvesting against armor. Harvesting against damage. I'm not. I, I don't want to buy any more of these. I, I want my defense, and I also want to start finding my uh, dodges again. So we bring that up to 60% again. I will continue buying bunnies. By the way, do you see how much money we have? Just straight up, I'm, I'm throwing a bit too much attack down the rabbit hole. Like, yeah, I'm, I'm throwing a bit too much damage away. I need to stop. I cannot stop myself. Um, Let's throw away this. Yeah, and stick to the nuclear launchers. I definitely need to stop buying these. Yeah, I need to buy like two more bees. And in general, stop buying those completely. Free <laughs> rolls. Oh, Obliterator is here. Just heavy. At least does 109 damage every a million seconds that it shoots. Uh, throw away the taser. Continue with the whole idea of rocket launchers and whatnot. And at this point, we have enough. So we're doing 28s, 35s, 114s. Yeah, I think we're damage-wise, we're really good. Continue with these, I would say. Uh, and these. Where will I find damage? I will need some damage ups, man. I guess here is the only damage. We lose elemental, we gain ranged. So this power is up, but this stays the same, right? 3d1? Still 3d1, exactly. My luck is already maxed out, so I don't need any more of the bees. Uh, I will continue with these. Continue reducing my pretty much everything. I don't have enough money here. Yeah, it is what it is. I don't want to buy a bee. 25 damage, 25 damage, 102 damage, 29 damage. Okay, we're very, very low on damage. But uh, how much? We have 1,800% harvest. 100, no, not percent, just flat out harvesting. Uh, I need like two or three more, two or three more golden chests. Of course, we're really, we really there. Uh, we get 37% more harvesting based on what we currently have on harvesting, and that, of course, um, is not actually 37%. It's 50% more of that. That means it's about 50% uh, harvesting. So from from 2,000 almost, we're gonna get up to about 3,000, maybe a bit less. So next round. And that's just gonna go up and up. Come on, explode, please. Yes, thank you very much. Of course, my luck is pretty high around it now, as we got all those uh, lucky items. And uh, I think I should really, really, really start investing into um, damage now. Like every single level, I should gain, I should try to gain, you know, levels. Uh, no, not levels. I, every level, I, I, try, I should try to gain more uh, damage, percentage-based damage for now, as I already have butchered my percentage-based damage. Look at this, we got plus 600. Oh, I was wrong on the 3000. I mean, I said a bit less, so I was actually correct. I'm gonna continue with the rich. We're gonna continue with the crowns. Four elemental damage, 12% damage. I'm gonna go with 12% damage. And uh, here, I'm gonna say three armor as we're negative in armor. What attack speed, to be honest? Let's get attack speed. Three range damage, that also fits. Three elemental damage, that also fits. If we're gonna go with the nuclear launchers, uh, rocket launchers here. I'm gonna combine... Actually, I'm just combine them with the rest. Reroll. Uh, this is the only harvesting I can actually buy, by the way. If we don't want to lose things. I can buy this and this, but we lose one range damage every time I do that. So, I'm not exactly sure if I want to do that. Uh, 2 HP recovered from items, lose 2 dodge. Honestly, no. Let's continue with these. Here we go, 15 melee damage. No, I'm kidding. This is useless for us. I will continue buying the these, though. And these. Th those are the two things I want to definitely buy. The fertilizers, the three things. The fertilizers, the metal detectors, as they give us luck and more money. And the... Oh, another one of those bazungas. And uh, the last one is, of course... Should I buy mines? 25 damage. Oh, you're going to buy mines. Why not? Pick up range, why not? A little bit of everything in harvesting. All of these help. This helps. This helps. Uh, rocket launcher. I would say yes to this. So let's combine these and buy this. Let's roll again. More of these, more of those. We are destroying our base. Here we go. Limited gentle alien. Where was that this whole time? Where are my gentle aliens? None of these. Now my rerolls came right there. <laughs> and now they're back again to nothingness. Uh, let's continue with pretty much everything. My damage is minus 50%. Oh no. Oh no. My damage is gutted. I'm gutting my own damage. Let's continue. Rocket launcher, another one. Nice. Let's continue. Uh, an SMG that does one damage. Nice. Be useful. Let's continue with the free rerolls. And <laughs> this whole joke of the free rerolls, I love it. The fact that every how many rerolls we get the free reroll. 
This is going to be the hardest wave, by the way. <laughs> this this next one. This next wave right here is going to be the hardest wave by far. Elemental damage and luck, but you lose engineering. I would say yes to this. As these are elemental damage attacks. Gentle alien. Luck against damage. Mm, I might as well. Harvesting. Now, the thing is that in this specific wave, theoretically speaking, we should... Uh, we should definitely, theoretically speaking, we should definitely, like my keywords are very bad, uh, but theoretically speaking, this should be the wave where we get like 10 boxes or something, because we already have 344 something luck, and I'm not going to be sticking here shopping all the time on every single wave, range damage, damage, everything, other than attack speed and crit, we are going to take that, we are a range damage build anyway, uh, continue with the free rerolls here, 125, nope, it's free, <laughs> everything is free, uh, my damage is mi minus 43% still. That's 47. And we're out of money. Let's go. Hoping that we're gonna survive this wave. Oh no. Oh no, the mummies are, are durable. Well, the obliterator doing 100 damage is always fun. Especially when I try to snipe with it. I think it just shot into the oblivion. Come on. Oh, that was a nice obliterator. I don't know if you saw it. It just straight up went to diagonal and straight up thing. This is a guaranteed chest. I mean, come on. Thank you. If that wasn't a guaranteed chest, I would know, man. I don't know what would be. And uh, we're losing a lot of life here when we get hit. We definitely have destroyed our own defenses. We have destroyed our own all damage. All the, everything for the, uh, for the money. Everything for the money. And uh, th this is like the payoff. The payoff are the levels that we're gonna get. So if we don't get like five levels here then uh, we will have some issues. If we get five levels, then we're really good. Because those five levels, alongside the luck we have, should give us, you know, three armor here, nine health there, some attack speed here and there, some damage. Because, yeah, we got like... Oh, it's slowly happening. 5,000. We have almost 6,000 harvesting. Continue scaling it. How much are we scaling now? 61%, which in reality isn't even 61%. It's 90% because, um, yeah, 50% on top of whatever you read. Uh, I need percent. Here we go for range damage. Guaranteed legendary. I would either go for four armor or 20% damage. I'm going to let's say four armor. Let's reroll these. Let's reroll these. We have so much money, you can easily roll four armor. 15 luck, honestly, no. Six melee damage, useless. Three elemental damage, also pretty useless. I want to get percentage based damage if I can. 8% damage, might as well. Not that it's that good. I like on harvesting, yes. Uh, reroll. Mm, and now rocket launcher. I mean, we're going to get all the legendaries at some point anyway. So, we're gonna continue just buying what we have said we're gonna be buying. These things. The, these things really help us because they maintain the damage of the nuclear launcher the same, but they increase the damage of rocket launchers and also obliterators. Uh, maybe nuclear launcher doesn't really fit in this build as we're trying to get weeds. I mean, from 36 and 50 to 36 and 51. It's not a, si a huge change, but it, it is something. And I will stop buying tractors now. I do still want the hats though, because luck is definitely making a difference. So Obliterator Legendary right away. I'm gonna say let's combine the nuclear launchers because honestly speaking, they will not really scale as fast as the rest of my weapons the way I'm playing this. So um, yeah, there's that, I guess. Once again, I'm not gonna really buy tractors. I guess they gave us the most harvesting between all of these things. Uh, but still, not being able to do damage isn't good. What? Why does this do three damage? I guess I have... A oh, now I actually have range damage. Well, I would like to take this. So maybe throw away the nuclear launcher. I think the time has come through the nuclear launcher. It does 71 damage. Yeah, we need something that attacks fast so we can also deal with small opponents. So bye bye nuclear launcher. I'm gonna do a nuclear launcher build maybe tomorrow. Uh, what is this? Lifesteal and dodge against a little bit of every damage type. I'm gonna say yes to this. Uh, yeah, we need some healing. We have the dodge. Like, we have we have dealt with dodge already. Oh, I should also buy the minus elemental damage and plus uh, lifesteal and whatnot. Those are of course gonna help us at this point as we will never ever go back to an elemental build anyway. Let's continue with these. Uh, lose a little bit of everything once again for even more lifesteal. Not that that's a good choice. Ooh, minigun legendary right away. Um, let's throw away one of the rockets and try to go for two miniguns, two rockets, and two obliterators. I think that sounds like a good um, combo of weapons here to have. So now I just need one more minigun and then we will have two for a nice, nice, nice. 69 by the way, the cost of that, nice. Range damage against range, I'm gonna say yes. No obliterator, by the way, what are my types? We are at heavy six, all of my weapons are heavy. We have two explosions, uh, this is nothing else, and two guns. So pretty much almost nothing. <laughs> almost nothing, let's reroll. Let's continue with those harvest. And by the way, look how much money we have. Potato, let's go, I love potato. 
And, uh, and can I get just a bunch of potatoes? That would be really nice. My heavy rolls cost zero forever. You see, <laughs> the, the more money you have, does anything matters. Continue with these. I'm not sure I should continue with these. The lifesteal is the only thing I'm actually looking when I'm looking at these. I might as well buy it, whatever. Let's continue. I'm also caring about those specifically. The wheats that give us two range damage per pop. So it's helping us. Let's continue with whatever. I have so much dodge. I should buy a couple of frogs more, by the way. Oh, HP region against luck. Mm, I, might, might as well. Might as well have some HP region. And I will also buy this. We have so much dodge right now. That doesn't matter that I'm throwing something away. Let's uh, yeah continue. I saw the electric blade there. I'm pretty sure people would like... Do you guys want to see like an electric frog build? Electric sword builds? Build? Not builds. Build. Like a run. Just to see how it's gonna go. I was thinking about doing something like that. Am I only finding the three th same things? A bunny. A bunny. Wheat. and A bunny. Fertilizer. And a frog. That's what I'm finding. Uh, let's continue scaling everything. Here we go. Even more. A bit of, you know, lifesteal. My lifesteal at this point is 21%. Which is pretty sizable. Now I just need to fix my attack speed. Movement speed for range. Uh, okay. Might as well. My range is at 9. It's his couch. Okay. We're finding actually unique things over here that I was not aware this guy had in his random items pool. Uh, by the way, you have so much money that we don't really need. Power fist, unarmed explosive. There's another thing I want to do a build with. Like punch and explode. There was... Oh, Retromation Sweetie is here. We're definitely going to buy that. 206 attack speed. That's instant fix on the attack speed portion. Uh, yeah, more capes. Gives us more attack speed, to be honest. Now that we have the cape. I, I really was not aware that I can actually get all those things with weighted items. So, uh, yeah, not a minigun. Let's continue. Theoretically, I could also get the blood donation now, but is there any reason whatsoever of why I would want to buy the... Oh, we're all almost out of money. Look at this. Well, look at that. Well, would you look at... <laughs> Projectiles can bounce. I'm gonna take this. I think it works on explosives. YOLO it. Not sure if it does actually work. YOLO it. So the first hit is gonna explode. Yeah, both hits explode. Like, they do... They, they hit, they explode, and then they bounce and explode again. I love it. So this was a correct decision, of taking that. Now I got a bouncing explosives. And honestly, I want to start skipping the shopping phase. Like, uh, my actual, truly actual plan is uh, to get to a point where I get so, so, so many levels from the harvesting that the shopping phase is irrelevant completely. Like, I don't, I don't want to sit there in the shopping phase and use all my money. I mean, look at this. Look how many... We already got four chests. It's, it's be, It begins. This is how it begins. It took us 27 minutes to get here, but now that we are here, I can tell you, madness has arrived. And this is now a chest right there. Very nice. We got like five or six chests. This is going to be... Uh, how many levels? Who knows? With, uh, with 7,000 harvesting, I think it's going to be like six levels. Maybe seven. And then, and then that can only go upwards, right? This can only scale more and more and more and more. <laughs> oh, look at this. It is actually seven levels. Wow. I fell exactly on the correct number. And here we're going to go with more harvesting, more harvesting, more harvesting, more harvesting, more harvesting. And uh, we're going to go with percentage-based damage. And we roll these. Uh, attack speed. I mean, I didn't need attack speed there. I'm going to go percentage-based damage here. Uh, or 20%. No, I don't need attack speed. I have uh, retromation. So the uh, four armor could be good. 12% damage, nice. Uh, I'm gonna go percentage based damage if I can. None of these, none of these. Uh, I have so much money to reroll, by the way. I, I don't even need to be afraid of anything. My range is negative. Let's get 45 range, why not? It's not like I can fix these numbers, by the way. Let's go. No, no, no. Percentage based damage. Nope. 12 harvesting. Nope. Once again, percentage based damage. Nope. 8% might as well. 3 armor. That sounds decent. I mean, I'm at 11. Might as well buy this. And uh, here we go. I have only 63 life, I just realized. That doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, we're going to continue with this. My attack speed still above base. And uh, honestly, I don't really want to go through this thing again. <laughs> I would really enjoy being able to do this extremely faster. But of course, we do want to get all that harvesting up and up and up. So we're still going to go through that. We found some bazookas here. What is this? Elemental damage and range damage for speed. Well, my movement speed is positive. No, I'm not gonna risk that. Just try to go for caps, fertilizers, not little frogs, stop buying these. Bowler hats, fertilizers, and bunnies. Now, that's the only things I want. And panda. Panda, yes. Panda, yes. Panda, good. Let's continue with everything we want. Not cows. Minigun. Yep. Those. 
Oh, two peaceful bees. Once again, not even aware you can actually find the same item twice. But here we are with mods proving the opposite. No, I do not want to buy that. More like lose engineering. Yeah, engineering is irrelevant. Although we have bought mines, engineering is actually irrelevant. No nuclear launcher. 58 damage. Yep, it's still on the lower end of things. Continue going for buying things. No, here we go. I might be missing some here and there, by the way. Uh, I don't think it really matters if we miss some things. Less attacks, but less dodge, less harvesting. 12% damage. Um, um, plus attack speed for every unique weapon you have. Yes. Well, we lost attack speed. Doesn't matter, we gain damage. Damage is what I actually care about. That's cool. Oh, I found my own relic. Mm, yeah, no, no, I have so much pickup range, my relic is useless. I'm sorry, guys. Let's go. Throws away his own relic. Let's go here. Let's continue. No. Another spider. Might as well increase our damage. My da my, my percentage-based damage is my real issue right now. That's the thing that needs fixing. So I will try to get as much as possible. My attack speed is, like, doable. And if I want to increase my attack speed, I just buy a couple of bees. Every bee I buy is going to be on attack speed. I mean, look at this. Uh, how much attack speed is that? From 112? 120. That was an 8% attack speed boost. And I throw away, like, from 62 damage, 62 damage, nothing on damage. So, this is definitely worth it. Gives us more attack speed. The bees, that is. Let's continue. Uh, of course, the more bees I buy, I do lose damage. Like, 397, 392. Like, I do lose slowly damage. Uh, but I can also gain it back with uh, leveling up. Uh, not leveling up, buying some good old wheats. Uh, should I go into an obliterator build instead of going into rocket launchers? I do enjoy what we have. I do enjoy the little bit of mix build here that we have. And in general, I have been enjoying those mixed builds we're doing. Now that we're doing those modded runs, we just find so many items and uh, I can just... Ooh, another double fertilizer. I think I should stop going for the bees now. I threw away just the fertilizer there. It is what it is. We continue with our free rerolls. Uh, trying to speed up the process here. Another bee. I should really stop with the bees, man. I'm killing my own money. Uh, not money, my damage. Okay, stop with the bees now. I'm not gonna buy any more bees. Nope. Yes, yes. <laughs> I like that we're finding so many bunnies. It's just crazy. Nope. Yes. Uh, yes on this. My crit chance is like non-existent. Which is minus 94%. Crit chance? What's that? <laughs> I don't know what crit is. There's a bit of damage. Continue increasing my attack speed. Through dodge. Oh, here we go. That's decent. A bit of dodge, which is useless. And armor, which is useful. And our little uh, potato. I love the potato. And our potato. Very nice. Can I find only potatoes? Is that like a choice here? Look at this. 140 or buy a B and zero. <laughs> money. The power of money. Let's... Uh, ooh, range damage. Lose HP region. Might as well. And harvesting for melee damage. Speed for range. Yes, yes. I should not have bought the B again. <laughs> Oof. Guys, I think I'm not gonna do another shopping spree. That is damage against attack speed for every weapon you have. Yes, my damage is my main issue, not my attack speed. I'm really good on attack speed. Uh, I think... Yeah, I, I really, really, really don't want to deal with this again. I'm gonna get the eyes poppers, why not? Damage life against engineering, yes. We're starting to find some web uh, some items here that do not seem to be weighted towards this character. So, th that's fun and nice. Look at this. this. This was not something that this was we were finding, and this neither. Like luck related items. Nope. Yes. Reroll. Yes. <laughs> Continue with the free rerolls. Yes. Reroll. And oh, my relic again. I'm not gonna take it. Oh, that's unique, and I could remove it from rotation. I prefer seeing myself. Ho ho ho. I'm kidding. And we have 14k harvesting, and we gain 150 harvesting each time. I think that's enough. I think it's enough. I think the shopping spree should stop now. What's my luck? 670 luck. I'm doing 250 something damage. Okay, damage wise we're good, of course. Actually, everything wise we're good. We're just straight up good. We're, we're busted. I think I can stop on trying to buy everything again. I'm not sure, man. On the one hand, I'm like... By the way, do you see that we have global magnet? I love it. Uh, on the one hand, I'm like... Maybe I should continue sh shopping normally. On the other hand, I'm like, yeah, but how long am I going to be shopping? I'm not sure if people do enjoy the shopping phase. I have read some comments and I think people like it. Like, uh, I, I guess you don't mind it. I'm saying people as if you guys watching are not people. I, I really hate when I do that. I mean, you guys. 
I'm not sure if you guys want to see more shopping, but it seems to be it's a bit repetitive. Like, we're always buying the same thing again and again. And it's not like, oh, Sift, why don't you then buy other items? Well, because most of the time, either either items don't appear or they just don't fit in general to the build. So, um, it's not like... Oh, 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 look how many levels we got. And we are at 36,000 harvesting. Guys, the scaling begins. Unique crown, unique crown, unique crown. Let's go. 60% uh, damage. I'm gonna say... My range is... Who cares? Might as well buy one range. I'm not gonna buy, imagine buying 10 harvesting. Crit chance, that's unfixable. I would say 3 dodge. Uh, when I say dodge, I mean armor. Let's try to get some... Uh, percentage based damage, honestly. Like, that's what I should focus on. 45 range is good. 60% damage, let's go. Guaranteed legendary. Uh, I mean... Movement speed sounds good. No, let's continue with the base percentage based damage. Come on. Come on. Percentage based damage. Hello? Hello? Am I blind? Like a punch, right? Feels like I'm blind. No, I'm not blind. It's just not giving it to me. Nope. Here we go. 6% damage. Elemental, pretty useless. Let's go 45 range. I want to fix my range a bit. Let's go 12 movement speed. That's now that it's there. And... Uh, <laughs> Honestly, I think I should not reroll anymore, man. I think I should not just continue this onward. This is this charade. This charade of just going through these again and again. I don't think I need this, man. I think we're very busted already. Oh, explosion damage. Nice. That's gonna help two of my weapons and reduce four of my weapons. YOLO it. <laughs> it's just so stupid that I bought that. Um, let's continue. Nope, I just threw away um, a hat. Oh, we can buy the weird ghost to lose the game on the spot. That's a good idea. Let's buy the bunny. Would be nice if I can just... Oh, here we go. Would be nice if I could just press 1, 2, 3, 4 to buy items. Instead of, you know, just needing to click. Or Q, W, E, R. Maybe that would also be helpful. You know, pretty much the same thing, to be honest. Continue gaining attack speed. Uh, wheat. Let's, let's try to only focus on specific things now. Range and melee damage, yes. Yes. I'm trying to speed up here by only buying bunnies, wheats, and um, those are the fertilizers. And the caps. Well, I cannot speed up, to be honest. Oh, we found explosion threat. I might as well buy it. Whatever. As if that matters. As if anything matters, to be that honest. As if anything matters. Nothing matters. We are busted. Uh, I don't need that. Let's continue. You know what? All of these don't even matter. I'm tr I'm, I'm adding like plus 8, plus 8, plus 8 harvesting. But we have 36,000. Like, I'm not adding anything. The only thing I should actually care about is the hats. Like, let's speed through this. Weeds and hats. Weeds and hats and nothing else. And, and the reason for that, by the way, is because hats give us luck. And luck means more items. And of course, maybe mega items too. And, 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 uh, and bunnies. Weeds, hats, and bunnies. That's it. Nothing else. Uh, so let's just go through here a bit faster and pandas and, and I, I said the, the big items. Yes That's yes. That's yes. No, I don't care about it. I should have picked up the, the butterfly though Another one of those nice continue and we have so much money <laughs> We're never gonna stop. It's never gonna stop and my rules cost zero after zero after zero after zero after zero After zero. I love it. Imagine buying that Get a little bit of attack speed there None of these, none of these, none of these. Four weapons, okay. None of these, none of these, none of these. Melee damage, no. Uh, bunny, I guess. Range damage against range. Damage isn't always yes, by the way. No, no, bunny. No, no. Melee damage, wow. I don't even know what the game is thinking about. You know what, maybe when I buy a bunny, I should also try to buy whatever else is in the shop at that point. Like, there is no reason to, for me to go down with my mouse. And then, um, if there is something else that fits the build, I'm just not buying it for some reason. Elemental luck and against engineering, yes. Uh, continue with the infinite bounces. Luck like engineering, yes. Can I get some? Oh, here we go. A little bit of everything. Lose some healings. I'm gonna say yes. Let's continue. I should not have bought that anyway. Let's heal here. Wheat, yes, as I said. App, yes, as I said. And bunny, yes. Trees, yes, thank you, for once. You know, for once we actually get trees. That's good, man, we have so much money. I love it, we are busted, man. This is just too much, too much. Should I promise now that I'm not gonna do a shopping spree again? Is that promise going to be actually truthful? I, I just got XP gain right there. XP gain is really good for us. 
Because XP... Oh, opponents move slower. We're starting to find items that are not part of the weighted items of this guy. <laughs> Which is really good, of course. Obliterator. Oh, there was a bunny. Oh, no. Who cares? Damage against attack speed. Yes, my attack speed is still in the super positives. So we don't care about it. We still have... I'm finding so many bunnies. And so many hats. You know what? I think... I think we're done. Like, honestly, 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 honestly. This is... this. The time has come for me to actually draw a line and say, yes, we are actually done. Like, this is my last shopping phase. I'm not gonna buy again anything. We have already 1,000 luck. We have already 37,000 uh, harvesting. Like, this, this is not gonna become better, man. I I, I mean, it, it can become better. Don't get me wrong. I, I can definitely continue scaling here. But the thing is that I don't need to. And uh, sometimes, you know, th there is a thing called value for money. And I'm going to translate, I am transitioning that over to value for time. And I think we're not gaining that much value out of what I'm doing right now. So uh, the moment I'm done with this amount of money, we will 100%. I promise. This is a SIFT promise, which does not happen very often. It's not a thing to say I'm going to do that and then I do something opposite. It's not a thing to say, I promise. From here on out, after this shopping phase, I'm never, ever, ever gonna shop again like this is it this is the final shopping phase what you're seeing is what you get we will uh we will just scale through harvesting for the rest of the game speed and dodge against arm yeah definitely definitely uh, the, yeah and this also armor again engineering against healing related items yeah we have so much healing like who cares you buy all of these uh etsy's couch lose the game <laughs> Kill your healing and move slower for no reason. Obliterator. I could have had so many obliterators. Um, yeah, I could have had so many obliterators. Let's roll. Uh, I do enjoy all of these, so let's just buy them. Uh, maybe not the B, but whatever. And we are almost out of money. And uh, the end is nigh. The end is nigh. We have gotten to the point where it's over. So let us go. I will never, ever, ever, ever shop again. Now, the run is in luck hand and luck i mean uh first of all i have a thousand luck so we're gonna get so many crowns but everything that matters is harvesting we will go with harvesting a madness i hope i'm gonna crash the game the plan of course is going to be that we get so many levels that the game is gonna like freeze and maybe crash if we do that then in my opinion it's a success uh, and of course then our plan is to get as many bucks here as possible now, uh, I haven't updated my mods to the newest patch where we it doesn't lag the more boxes you get. So the more boxes we will get, it will start lagging a bit. But that doesn't really matter to me, honestly. Like, if it just lags a bit when I'm buying my crowns, it doesn't matter. We're not gonna shop again, ever, at all. We're gonna just stick next to next to next to next, and we're gonna scale through leveling. The leveling is going to be the one that's gonna break the game. Now, uh, my plan is to uh, try to get specific level ups for the, I don't know, first 20 levels, 30 levels, look at how many levels we got. And this is just gonna become more and 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 more. And let's hope we crash the game, man. I'm telling you. Let's hope we crash the game. Go here, boom. I forget that it's an engineering. Lags, legs, and legs, nice. We're gonna go range. We're gonna go, um, I don't know. Let's get, uh, actually, the plan is health and percentage base damage. We want percentage base damage, percentage base damage, percentage base damage. Yeah, thank you, 16%. Of course, we have so much luck that we should never accept anything. Uh, whatever. Speed, speed. Uh, okay, that's another legendary here. I'm going to say percentage base damage. Yeah, I have so much luck. I should never accept anything below blue. Range damage, might as well. Rage regen, might as well. Uh, 20 attack speed. No, let's go with, once again, 12% damage. That's really important. Where's the 20% damage? Come on. Come on. Uh, 12, here we go, 16%, not even 12. I don't need more luck. Reroll, speed. Uh, two armor, might as well. Uh, I'm just gonna buy here the starting ones and go. <laughs> Whatever appears in the shop right away, I will buy, of course, but other than that, I don't care about it anymore. Like, we're done. We, we have so much, what's my harvesting right now? 114,000. 140,000. And that's gonna become like 200 plus. Ooh, uh oh, look how many boxes we got already. And just like that, the madness begins. The plan to overclock the harvesting. Can I get enough harvesting so that the value, you know, the. What is it called? The thing that stores it, I guess the. What is it called in coding, man? My coding language has gone out the window <laughs> since the last year. Uh, I guess it's... Um, 
you know what? The variable, yeah. The, whatever variable variable stores the harvesting, if it's an integer, will we be able to crash it and make my harvesting go down to zero? Or will it just start writing and seeing like huge weird numbers? We're gonna see. We're gonna see. Oh, 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 oh look how many levels. Sound effects still going on. Oh yeah, those sound effects are gonna be glitching the universe later. Uh oh. It's gonna start lagging here while I'm picking these. Next more. Next more. 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 Okay, and one last one. Oh, I have more. Okay, thank you very much. I'm gonna go and uh, move. That, that, that's attack speed, by the way. 9% dodge is attack speed for us. Movement speed, why not? This is a guaranteed, I would say, range. Armor. Dodge is attack speed. Range damage is damage. Dodge is attack speed. I'm gonna say let's go with 4 armor here. Does it even matter? Uh, by the way, I'm slowly gonna start transitioning over to just straight up clicking, whatever. Uh, I, I don't really need like all of these. At the end of the day, we will become like super tanks anyway. So yeah, nothing really matters. I'm gonna even fix my crit chance the way I'm seeing this. Try to get... Maybe I should have gotten the 4 flat range damage. No, I have 41 already. I have 4 armor, whatever. And max life, uh, 10 luck, whatever, 4 armor. Now crit chance. Mm, I don't know. For armor, I guess. Free range damage. And we're done. As I said, we will buy whatever appears in front of us. And uh, off to the next one we go. And we have 424,000 harvesting. Which just will become more and more and more and more. And we're gonna crash the game. So theoretically, the hundred something we had become... Well, by the way, I'm scaling at a pace of 285%. 285% scaling on the harvesting. That means that... Um, that's not actually 200... Let's say it's 300%, right? So that means it's not 300%. It is 450% because we gain 50% more than what it actually shows. So right now, we are scaling at a pace of about four times more multiplier. That's the, the rate we're scaling right now. So, uh, yeah, that means uh, whatever we have right now, four times more the next round. And then the round after that, we're going to have 16 times more than what we have currently. And then after that, it's like uh, four times six is 12, four, four times six is 24. So that's like, four, it's about 70% more. Oh man, we got so many levels. Yeah, we have gotten so many levels that the box are barely visible. Sound effects. Okay, nice. And uh, now we're scaling at a pace of 370%. So my my, my, my uh, harvesting is already at 2 million. Okay, 2 million harvesting. Uh, whatever, does it even matter what I pick at this point? I don't think it does. Uh, I got some engineering. <laughs> Mental damage, whatever. Range, speed, range, armor, uh, damage, crit chance, range, damage, uh, attack speed, I guess. Range damage. Dodges attack speed, uh, HP regen, HP movement speed, dodges attack speed, I guess range damage, two or more, two range damage, 16 damage, could we roll all these by the way, crit chance, I'm gonna get my crit chance up, I'm gonna get my crit chance to a point where I'm okay with it, 16% damage, 60 range, <laughs> ranges through the roof, I don't want any of these. Let's go range, let's go health, let's go uh, armor, how much armor have I gotten from these man? Or flat, why not? Lifesteal, movement speed, and here we go. I will once again buy anything that I care about here, and let's go. Hey, look, it's an elite. Da -da 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 elite is a toast. We have had more powerful runs, but uh, we have 242 life. My harvesting is at 2 million. Yep, and it's gonna become most likely a billion. Um, no, no, from 2 million, I'm, I'm assuming we're gonna get about 10 billion. Uh, million, 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 around the millions right now. From the 2 million, we will most likely get 10 million next. So I start feeling like the dream of crashing the game is not really happening. Unless, I mean, next after this, my harvesting is going to be 10 million. And then after that, it should become about 50 to 100 million. And then after that, I think the game's over. So I don't see us being easily getting a billion. Although we got so many chests here. The previous round, we didn't get that many chests, to be completely honest. And to be completely, completely honest, of course, if I invested all the money I'm gaining into pretty much whatever in the shop, I will become more powerful and get more harvesting. But honestly, I don't want to deal with it. And I don't think you guys want either. Look at this. We just got 7 million harvesting. So that's like 1 to 3. Uh, 1 to 3. We got 12 million harvesting right now. 12 million. 
and we're gonna continue increasing that with a couple of crowns. The level up sound effects just have bugged out completely. Yeah, game. Yeah, game. I know. Uh, let's... Who knows how many levels I have, actually, lined up right now. So let's just start going through these as fast as I possibly can. Let's just pick up whatever I see first. And uh, if it's a bad choice, it is a bad choice. Like, who cares? Honestly. <laughs> I could have gotten the dodge there. This is like sift speed compressing. As uh, nothing really matters at this point. Range damage. Armor. Uh, melee damage. That was useless. <laughs> I want to see how many useless picks I'm going to make. <laughs> it's like that was also useless. It's like a mini game. Attack speed. Dodge was better though. Um, luck. Armor. Attack speed. Uh, you know what? Let's go movement speed. Attack speed. Range damage. Attack speed. Uh, all of these are useless. We found in all of these are useless. Point there. Uh, the range, crit chance. I think we're slowly closing into a 12% movement speed. Uh, dodge, yes. Luck, attack speed, uh, life steal, attack speed, dodge, attack speed, heal. Yeah. Okay. Um, how many more do I have to go through? Just clicking wherever at this point. Okay, I think we're in the end. Yeah, we're in the final line. In the final uh, stretch. And we become more and more powerful by the minute. By the way, my crit chance is slowly getting fixed. <laughs> I don't see it happening, though. I don't see us being able to get it all. I'm about to say, like, forget the crit chance, but whatever. There we go. Attack speed. If steal and melee damage. Nice. <laughs> go. Good thing we got the melee damage there. And uh, now we have 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 12. Wait, what? 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. Wait, what? I have 12 million. No, the game doesn't scale me anymore. No, the game the game does not scale me anymore. No, that was, that's a bug, I guess. We 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 made it so it, it can't scale anymore, I guess. That's sad. That's very sad. But oh, come on, man. Why 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 am I stuck at 12 million? Or, or did it already happen? Oh yeah, I think it already happened. I think I was at 2 million and then I was like, okay, now I have 12 million. And now I'm like reading it again. I'm like, oh wait a minute, we're still at 12 million. <laughs> I think that is what happened. Yeah, because I was calculating that next round we're gonna be about 50, and then the one after that we're gonna be about 100. Actually, from 50 I'm most likely gonna get up to 500. So, yeah, I think we're gonna get a, a bit shy of a billion. A bit. A bit shy of a billion. I really hope we're gonna get a billion harvesting. It's a bit sad that, of course, the waves end, but I mean, I cannot even... If, if this game was able to get up to wave 3D, <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna become so, so powerful. So powerful. Of course, this time I'm gonna get so many levels that I'm not even gonna look into um, what upgrades we get from levels. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I was actually correct about this. So we just got 1, 2, 3, 1, 3, 88 millions. 88 millions. And until the sound effect's gone, we're gonna just be pressing this uh, cron button here a million times. And uh, yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna even look at these. I'm not even gonna look at these. They just scale whatever. I don't even care what they gain. I mean, look at this. We're still gaining levels. We're still gaining levels. Yep, look at this. I'm not even doing anything. Now, now the sound effects of level stopped. Okay. And uh, here we are. The wave is incoming until it gets to the middle. And then we are done with the levels. And very nice. Uh, I don't even know what I was gaining. And I don't even care what I was gaining. Look at how much money we have. Wait, one, two, three, one, two, three. 12. Wait, what? Oh, yeah, because you first get the 12 million and then it propagates. So we have 88 million and it scales at the rate of 450%, which once again, it's not actually 450%. It's about 600 plus because of the 50% more than what it says. Plus, I'm running like the wind. I have 678 life. I have uh, my harvesting ready. And uh, honestly, once again, I will not be able to get to a billion, which is a bit sad. But we are completely and utterly busted. I did get 5 billion coins when I was doing the piggy bank run. Uh, but yeah, the idea, once again, is that we get a bunch of levels. Now, uh, if I could have gotten more levels, of course. I could have gotten more levels if I invested into more XP gain. If I, instead of investing every single one of my boxes here into more crowns, I could have gotten more levels out of it. Especially these specific ones. Uh, the, the previous ones. Like, if in the previous round I have gotten, uh, I have chosen a bunch of XP gain, and then in this way we would have gotten, like, double, triple the levels. But honestly, I, I don't care about that. I care more about the fun of harvesting through the roof. And although I will most likely not gain more harvesting, I think we're gonna be able to get the very, very, very last wave. I think the very last wave of opponents is going to give us that last boost for a billion. So we're at 600, 687 million right now. 
And uh, yeah, this gling 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 is gonna take a while. We're gonna continue with just picking up crowns. Okay, and now we're gonna just click the first one. And then we're gonna transition over to the second one, a bit of the third one, a couple of the last one. Let's go back to the third one, go back to the second, a couple of the first, as if that matters, by the way. Uh, you know what I can actually do? I'm gonna... I'm gonna see how lucky I am. I have an idea here just to play around, to meme it around, I guess. I'm gonna make the rerolls here. Well, look how many we have, by the way. We're still waiting for the last one to... Look <laughs> what's happening. My stats are slowly scaling. Okay. Is the sound effect still happening? Wow, the level up sound effect is still happening. This is unbelievable. Excuse me, sound effect. Can you, like, stop? Good thing I decided to actually just speed roll this. Uh, here we go. We're back in the game. Back in the game, boys. And you know what we're gonna do here? Just for the memes, you know, just for the fun. Let's actually re-roll these. And let's say I'm gonna choose the first one. And depending on if the first one is going to be anything that makes sense for the build uh, or not, we're gonna know if this is a successful build or not. I'm just gonna make this re-roll here cost as much as humanly possible. Oh, come on, man. Let's speed click this. I... Can I reroll by button? Nope, I cannot reroll by button. So, I was assuming that this was gonna scale a lot faster. This is very disappointing, to be honest. This scales like 5 at a time, I think. Wait, does it actually scale 5 at a time? Ah, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see, I see. The creator of this mod... You know what, forget it, this takes too long. I'm gonna roll 10 more times, and then whatever is in the first spot is the decision point. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Engineering. Okay, we failed. We lost. We lost. It's 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 a it's a run. We lost the run. Okay, let, let's abort this run. <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's actually go. Final boss. Boss is dead. Game crashed. I got so many levels. We're gonna hear the sound effect until the game ends. Yep, the sound effect is going to be here. So we got at the end one two three one two three one two three five billion harvesting. And if I was one more wave alive, this would have, would have become like fifty billion, if not more. So, uh, yeah, I'm gonna do actually the outro here while the sound effects are playing in the background, just for the memes. I hope you guys enjoyed the run. If I press main menu, is the sound effect still gonna continue? Oh, awesome. Love it. So, yeah, once again, I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like and subscribe to the channel. What a fun run. Uh, very simple in the execution, I have to say. But still, it was fun regardless. Uh, with all those money, money, you could, of course, buy everything in the shop. But honestly, I didn't want to go through that. It's a bit too much. Uh, who cares, in my opinion. And uh, yeah, what an awesome run. What a busted run. What a buggy run, too. <laughs> the sound effect is still playing. So, yeah. Uh, as always, thanks for the Patreon membership supporters. And uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Once again, thanks for watching. And see you guys around. We're going to be here for a while. Hey, everybody here. I love you guys. Right, it's done. See you guys around.